It's Friday night in downtown Norfolk and people have fewer options to hang out with friends tonight. But city leaders are increasingly facing pushback from business owners after shutting down nightclubs. Scott Oaks is the owner of Scotty Quicks, the original owner. He told us the city's attempt to curb crime is misguided. Council revoked the establishment's conditional use permit over inconsistencies with meal tax reports. To me, what the city is doing and the way that they're approaching this is, is completely backwards. They're going after the lifeblood, the, the tax revenue generators downtown as a means to get rid of crime versus beefing up the police presence and, and you know, it, making it a much safer place for people to go. Judge also is speaking out, petitioning the city to help provide assistance to those impacted by the crackdown. 13 News now received a statement saying the life expenses of these students, single parents, veterans and military spouses did not end with the votes made. Councilman Tommy Schmiegel argues this is an example of accountability. We're not playing around. They knew that this was coming. And so when you break the law, you are being held accountable. City also revoked the conditional use permits for California Burrito and Culture Lounge.